how's it going? Um, today is a DIY Wednesday. Um, I'm just going to do a couple of sh really small um, sort of like Easter DIYs. I've got some cones, some moss. This was from somewhere, Amazon, I think this one was. And I've got the one of the chopping boards from Poundland and some... Uh, daisies that was off this egg from last year's DIY if you remember that um, I've just pulled them out <laughs> I'm thinking of actually doing something with this as well maybe put some moss around the top and uh, I don't know yet but I've got a few of those some uh, carrots from Poundland some little sprigs from the works I have a reef here that's just been plain since I bought it this was from Hobbycraft and it was about three pounds, so I'm thinking of doing something with that. And I did one of these last year, but it took me so long. I was like, I'm not doing another one. But, but these are really bright and um, a bit, you know, not garish, but they're very Easter, like child Easter. And I was thinking of just making a few more of these that I can have them plotted I'm start around. Start off with the chopping board. And I just want to make something that I can hang above my cooker. Um, because I've got one there at the moment and uh, yeah let's see how that goes um, no idea how I'm going to do it yet uh, so I'll sort of let my mind do what it's got to do and um, yeah I'll see you uh, I won't see yeah I'll yeah I'm just going to get on with it
So this one's going to be done in pretty much the same way. Um, I'm going to cut the twigs and stick them down and put some little uh, carrots on it. And that will be this one done. So this is DIY number two. And that's that one complete. I didn't glue anything down because I love this reef as it is. So I don't really want to uh, change it dramatically. So um, yeah, that was that. I think it goes this way, but it doesn't matter. Um, but anyway, that was the DIY number two. Okay, so DIY number three is going to be these cones. I'm going to cover them in the moss and then put the flowers, just sort of like scatter the flowers. I am actually running out of space with my uh, phone, which is really annoying. So I'm going to literally speed this one up and um, hopefully we can get it done before the time. I've ruined my nail as well. That's fantastic. Um, so yeah, that's the uh, that's the tree. There's a little bit showing through still, I can see, but it's only for decoration purposes. So the next one I'm going to do with twine. I'm going to just wrap the remaining uh, twine around the cone and do a, yeah, a jute string one.
Okay, so what I'm going to do is just carry on and then we'll swap to the thinner one at the top here. So for this uh, smaller strand, I'm going to use two um, balls and then hopefully it won't take as long. But I am going to speed this bit up because it is going to take me a hell of a long while to finish the rest of this. So yeah, bear with me guys. Apologies for going off camera as well guys because my glue gun doesn't reach and I'm sat on the opposite the other side of the table um, So yeah, I'm uh, so sorry for that um, But I mean it's not exactly the most riveting part of the DIY Literally just going round and round and then even afterwards if there's any gaps showing I can use the thinner twine to just go round ah and uh, yeah, fill in the gaps. Oh look, that one's stuck. So yeah, that's all I'm doing. And I'm gonna do this right until the very end and then I'll come back to you when I have finished. And there we have it that one is complete um it's actually looking really good uh no idea how i'm gonna decorate it though i might use the eggs or i've got some um uh confetti uh from one below which was like 95p i'm not sure whether to use the eggs and just stick them on or i might just leave it as is maybe put a one single flower at the top not sure yet I could do that actually. That's quite cute. Oh, I'll do that. I'll do that. Oopsie. Oh, I could put a bow. A little bow. Yeah, let's put a little bow. And then put the flower on. <laughs> oh dear. Sorry if you can hear the TV in the other room. The kids don't know how to... Uh, uh, listen to it on a normal volume. Right, let's make that there. Is that the front? That can be the front. Put a little blob of glue. And then we can attach the flower. I'm hoping it doesn't get too uh there we go it might be a bit much <laughs> it's a bit ott um but when have you ever known me to care but anyway that's my two little trees i'm going to put those on the uh, table now as display and um yeah the last diy i'm going to do exactly the same um as the tree and i'm just going to wrap a few of the eggs uh, with the twine. Um, I'm not going to film that part because I have run out of space and otherwise I won't have no no uh, space to actually film the last part of the DIY as in show you what they look like. So I'm just going to start this now 
and this is all I'm going to do so it will come out looking a bit like this this is one of the lights the eggs the lights from pound shop Poundland, and uh, but these are the polystyrene hanging ones I'm going to leave the hangers just in case I do want to hang them up and uh, yeah I'll come back to you when it is all done and I'll film what everything looks like so you can see all together okay guys I'll see you at the end Thank you. 